Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. We've got Father's Day baseball. It's the Chicago White Sox and the Arizona Diamondbacks. First pitch coming your way next. Just about ready to roll, showing the slab in today's game, Jordan Montgomery. Well, you know this guy wants to be better than that. I mean, the ERA is bloated. He understands that he's got to put his team in a better position to win ball games. And at this point, you have to forget about your own individual stats, and you have to go out there and attack and try to get that W. And if you do that, you'll look up, and most likely that ERA will have dropped over time. Pulls it in for the out. Time to check out the lineup for the White Sox. And so far this year, this has not been a very good offense. Well, in this day and age, if you can't slug and get on base, that OPS has to be at a certain level. If you're going to produce runs, give your pitchers an opportunity as they're facing tough offenses as well. In the air, left field, Griel has it sized up. He's got it, and there's two away. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. Moreno makes the grab, and that is that. One, two, three, go the White Sox. And now Arizona gets its first opportunity in a scoreless ball game. It's Major League Baseball, and it's on the show. And we're back. And towing the slab, Eric Benny. Tell us about him in that sub-3 ERA singing. Well, anytime you can keep your ERA under three, you're doing a lot of things right, and you're putting your team in a position to win a lot of ball games as well. And he's doing tremendous out there on the mound. Every time he gets the ball, you expect him to go out there and dominate. And that's what this one swung on and hit well. Way back there. Goodbye, Hopper! He nails one out to right. It's one nothing. He only needed one swing to square it up. Not wasting any time in that and bad move. Aggressive and it paid off. Love to see a hitter aggressive on his first pitch of an at bat. You watch it from the on deck circle. So when you step in the box, you're ready to pull the trigger wherever it's at. Really good job by the hitter. Total conviction on that swing. Pulls it in for the out. Time to take a look at the Diamondbacks lineup. And Chris, this group has been struggling to put up runs lately. Well, they haven't been on base a ton, and even when they are, they haven't been hitting very well with the runners on base. So they need a player or two to really step up, have some quality at bats, hit according to the situation, and sort of break out of this. I think if they do, the rest of this lineup will follow. Here's Jack Peterson. There's a swing and a drive. In this inning, the long ball was working. It's now a 2-0 ball game. You're watching Major League Baseball on the show. New inning getting started. Here's the veteran shortstop, Aldi Young. 
Montgomery back to work. Now fly ball to right center. Carroll hustling after it. Got it. Covered plenty of distance there. And there's one away. So digging in, Corey Jones. Popped up to the left. Into foul ground. Suarez calls it in. And there's two away. Two outs, base is empty. And now Corey Lee. On the ground. It's through for a hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Now, no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pick. Just found a way to slap that ball down the third baseline. That's really excellent back control. And it kind of goes back to all those drills you see hitters do on the team where it's placed in different spots. That's just nuts. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. With the tying run at the plate, you're at the top of the second. After their first drop, it's a good change of the hit up in the zone. I don't think he recognized it. I'm sure he'd love to have that one back. Battling here as he fouls it away. Clearly they try to stay back a little bit longer for that change up as he fouls that fastball back. He goes down looking. So no runs here on a base hit, no errors, and one left. We go to the bottom of inning number two. It's the Diamondbacks two and the White Sox nothing. Back now with a new arm of the mound to start the bottom of the second, Jonathan Cannon. And if you dig into his walk rate, his numbers are really impressive. You know, it's really filled up the strike zone this season, so these batters better be ready to swing the bats. In a pitch. That one lifted to left, Jones under it, one up, one down. Really nice job to get your first out of the ball game. And you had to go Suarez up to hit down. Swung on, walked it. Way back there. against the biggest names in the sport. Here comes a pinch. Right side, Mendick. Gathers and throws the first. That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. D-backs get one on the solo jack. It's now 3-0. Major League Baseball is on the show. Back here in the desert, leading off, Danny Mendick. Montgomery back to work. And a big swing and a miss. Threw that fastball right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. Let's see if he continues to climb the ladder. And that one is lifted in the air. Carroll moves towards it. He's there. He's got it. One away. Martin Maldonado up to him. First pitch, just misses. One out, base is empty. Top 
top of the zone, and it's called a strike. Swings and misses, and it's one and two. Fights it off, you'll see another. And a pitch. That's foul off to the right side, keeps the AB going. The Diamondbacks leading by three. A little bit high. It's a good take. And here it comes. In the air to left center. On the boot. That'll drop in as he plays it on the hop. He saw a lot of pitches in that at bat and found a way to win the battle. Back to the top of the lineup. Here's Tommy Pham. First offering and it just misses. Maldonado leads off first with one away. That one fouled off. Comes up empty. That's strike two. Here, I love it. Yeah, there's ball four. Well, interesting, he went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you gotta challenge the guy for fastball. Ball in the box now, take strike one. Not sure exactly what he was thinking there. Good sinker ball pitcher goes with the fastball in a double play situation when he needs something on the ground. Squeezes it. White Sox down to their final out. And now the center fielder, Luis Robert. That misses. 1-0. Oh. Home plate umpires trying to tighten things up a little bit. Strike on the inside corner. Get a little frustrated with the strike zone. One strike away. Up towards right center field. McCarthy settles under it. He's got it. Ball game. And the Diamondbacks. This is just a nice way to bring up a ball game. You don't talk to them about the three runs that you score, but you also know that if you're not careful, a bloop, a base hit, the home run ties everything up. But it was great pitching, timely hitting, which made the difference. A shutout in this one. Three nothing, our final score. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. We'll see you soon.